Welcome back guys to Tales of Exilia where thanks to you guys we're back in the Kuka Ice Caverns because as someone pointed out in Kambala Inn there was a way to activate the boss within here monsters in the cave defeat the aqua dragon we have to 100 Kambala ask our heroes to exterminate the aqua dragons that thrive in the Kuka Ice Caverns so we spared the talking as it were and we're just gonna get straight in there let's see this aqua dragon the opposition of the fire teagles I imagine. Something on that. How am I going to be able to squeeze... Um, Turtle, I don't want to fight you. Get out of my way. Shiny. Monster fluid on the icicles. Cool. I like the way you say opposition. It makes me think it's like rival football teams or like blitzball teams. They're the opposition. Well, it seems that instead of the fighting, we got double the fun over here. Aqua Dragon 1 and Aqua Dragon 2! Well, I've got power hits just on my normal hits, so you're not going to enjoy this, are you, sirs? <laughs> Are we just all using fire hits to just mince them up? I wonder how much HP they've got as a whole. They've got not that much, so we should be able to take them out quite nice and fast-ish. Oops, I might not actually do my... Uh... Did you defeat it already? Yeah. Just. Ooh, efficient timing that was. You're just breaking all the people! <laughs> I've not even got my down barely, now you've just... <laughs> Stronger than I look. I'll protect I... you. Oh, I like my gloves. It kind of looks like what are those fossilized creatures? It's, it's not an am ammonite because they're the ones oh, that are circular. Kabuto? Um, similar. To <laughs> I'm thinking Pokemon. Uh, uh, Trilobite. Is that the one? Trilobite. Yeah. All right, I imagine. I but... should know this stuff. We got ourselves Spirit Bangle and Heal Bangle here, <laughs> and another boss defeated in about two seconds. Well done, Becca. I helped so much. Well, you're in the title Ice Melter for our troubles. Yeah. So let's head back to Campbell and give that in because, of course. Where do we want to go this episode? The storyline? Oh, that thing! I don't know what that is anymore. The storyline where the final bosses await. No, I haven't fought in a very long time. I guess no one wants some old geezer channeling spirits for them. No, nope, go the to the home. We, we just need a Jude. Go to the home! <laughs> How harsh. How harsh. Right, let's buy myself some more spicy chicken because we always have to do such a thing. I mean, there was a time when we liked the beefs, but white meat is a little bit better, isn't it? Yum. For not clogging your arteries and stuff like that. Well, let's head in to where the old man is waiting and say, Hey, uh, these guys that you were worried about that came out, they took like two seconds as well. You did it! Without a single one of you getting killed! Quite the accomplishment, yes, okay. I'm glad the crisis is resolved. I still can't forgive the idiots who caused this mess. What sort of lunatic goes around picking fights with incredibly powerful monsters like that? Uh... <laughs> That's kind of what we did. We got ourselves a sensor bar, which seems to be... Is it just the thing you have Wait, on top of the telly what? from the Wii? You just glue um, it to your forehead. <laughs> this it is! is. <laughs> I think it is actually the Wii sensor bar, yeah, this isn't is the it? the perfect accessory sewn on the lamb. Don't even think about peeking out from it. Oh, I see. It's like someone's been censored. Yeah. Oh, I quite like that. They should do a little laughing man one, like in Ghosts in the Shell, that'd be amazing. It weird as anything. But with another side quest done, I could not find Le Leia's journal whatsoever. So, if it is anywhere, I don't know. Couldn't find that, someone mentioned that in the comments on top of that. It's time to go back to Showerton. Give him our jet black feathers. And engage in the last bit of that. There's no ivory treasures. Yeah. You know I can't <laughs> <come away. laughs> It doesn't matter what we're doing, we could be getting told off in Kung Fu, or we could I could be being questioned by the police. I would still hiccup inanely. Mind you, have you noticed what's wrong with this situation? He's not here. He's not here. There Mr. Is Man here. is here, however. Come to see the trader? He left a while ago. Said he had some urgent business to attend to. Darkwing has struck again! He's attacking merchants south of here on Comar Trail! In other words, go there, but not in its usual weird sub-event form. <laughs> maybe right. we'll get one. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Comar Trail. We search on the other thing. We should be able to find it, but we should... let's go for the Birmingham Gorge side, because it's probably further on within it. He says, now completely doubtful. He's attacking merchants. Well, it's all that kind of gap. Hopefully he's on the far side. You kind of hope so. Attacking merchants on the Comar Trail. Where are you? Keep your eyes out, Becca. You're the observant one. I hope he really does look like a bad, like, drag act or something and just loads of black feathers. Well, I think we found him, no problem, and no, he does he not. He looks like a normal soldier. <laughs> yes. That sucks. 
Oh no, he does look fair, but please spare me, you're Darkwing, right? Aren't you supposed to help people? Oh, I used to, but that charade proved more trouble than it was worth. Okay then, it's just poor form to leave eyewitnesses alive. Poor form? Hold it! It's Straight to battle versus someone I imagine we are going to overwhelm a little bit. Yes! Just yes. a little bit. I just don't feel like fighting. I know that Becca's just going to break them all with her fists as usual. Aha! Took it away into the sky! That's the way to defeat her. Alright then, Darkwing! Damn it! This wasn't supposed to happen! Or well, maybe it's not him. The feather Trader? What are you doing here? Sorry about all this. He was my partner. I should have been the one to stop him. Your partner? He and I used to work together as the Dark Wings. We'd only steal from the rich to help the poor. We use these feathers because they bring good luck. After we struck a few hundred to our bodies, yeah, sure. There was no one alive who could catch us. Why? I'm not sure. But his creed got the better of him. He took all our feathers and became a ruthless thug. So you were collecting those feathers to catch him? Exactly. I didn't think I had enough feathers yet. We brought you some more. <laughs> yes, we have even more. Would you want some more? <laughs> we have tons of the stuff. Who oh, have 459 feathers. I guess that was enough to beat his luck. It wasn't luck. It was the strength of your resolve that stopped him. Except you didn't do anything. <laughs> Thanks for saying that. The feathers seem to have lost their power, so I hope you'll accept this instead. What do we get? A 459. If you ever find any more jetpack feathers, please bring them to my store. I don't want what happened to my partner to ever happen again. Sure thing then, we got an Excel and 50,000 gold now. If I remember correctly, an Excel as an item is the one that gives you an extra bit of AC. Do 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 do. We should have two of them. Oh no, one. Oh, it gives two AC points. Could that be really handy to change to now? Would you like an extra two XL in place of 10% strength? To be honest, I strength? don't find myself running out very often. So no. if you want to use it, carry on. I'm fine as well. Uh, <laughs> right. Um, yes. I oh, guess. Let's kill the game. I guess that's it. We're done. Do it. No, we're, we're done. We're, 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 we're sub-evented out. Cool. Let's go. Let's go. Guys, we're going. I can't actually believe it. I don't know what's going on. Where do I go? Uh, to the Other world? The dimensional rift? Where, where do I go? Ah! Calm down, dear. It's the storyline ending. We've been waiting for like, I don't know how long we've been sub eventing for, but still. Here we go. Fight some elementals, eh? Using my powerful e freeds and the whatnot. Or Becca could just break the bosses again. I, didn't... <laughs> I wanted to get to the story. <laughs> <laughs> you really did. <laughs> right then, Temporal Crossroads, we are back. And it should be down this way, if I remember correctly. Yep. What a crazy place, but that's okay. We're used to it. Obviously. Makes okay, me fancy guys. jelly. Why jelly? Because you start with jelly cubes. Oh, okay. Je this jelly Let's cube land, in. is it? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, get defeated, guys. There's a bit of slowdown going on, though. It seems I got that guy's tail from long range. Oh, nice Undine shot there, only getting one hit on him. And my bombs didn't even finish off the last wind elemental. I refuse to run away. Yep, we'll break through without much of a problem whatsoever. Man, well, let's step forward at last. If you jump down from here, you will not be able to return. Never mind, let's the do it. The point of no return is here. We continue onwards, of course. There was a leap. Oh, Ooh. who's that? I think we know. It's over, isn't it? Yes, it's Wingle. That's what I said. <laughs> So you've made it this far. I'm assuming you're not going to just let us pass. Of course not. You should know well enough why I stand before you. Turn back now. You know we cannot oblige to that. Why are you so adamant about meeting his highness? We must stop him and dispel the schism. 
It is the only way for the people of Riza, Maxia, and Olympias to come together. So you side with the Olympians now? Your fickle self-righteousness sickens me. I don't understand what His Highness sees in you. You will die here before you become any further burden to him. We'll see about that. I think we have to shave him after we beat him and then he'll be perma-defeated. <laughs> yes, what? Well, if he doesn't have hair that you can change colour with. Ow, ow, ow! Power's in his hair. Right, he's weak to earth attacks, which means I've got a good one for you. Oh, except he's kind of dodged me horrifically with speed. Wake up Yes, he's, he's very movable. There we go, quick breaker for a big ton of damage, but... He's about to use his Mystic Art, I think. <laughs> he wants me, though! <laughs> Becca! <laughs> He's a slippery eel. He is a bit. Go on, Gnome, get him from range. Oh, Gnome! You weird fool person. Like, he kind of knocks me out quite easily. Wow, his amount of stunning that he does is quite serious. Well, Becca's on a rampage this episode. I don't like your emo hair. <laughs> so that's the reason why. <laughs> why does he just dodge you and go straight for me? Get in there, Gnome, do some power hits. Ow! Oh, his annoying attacks, man. Ready? Got it. Go on, walk into me. Dare you. Oh. Good. Good, good. Hey. He does not like Alvin, that's for sure. Alvin's barely alive. And I'm really hurt as well. Oh, no, there goes Alvin. I put him down, but that supernova's coming in here. <laughs> we cannot let him cast. I think that's some kind of hint there. All right, I'll get resurrected up again, but it seems he's back ready to use Lightning Nova anytime now. Well, I managed to block quite a lot of the attacks there, but I'm expecting a Lightning Nova to come in and break us any time. You're bouncing around with destructive plays, are you? Go. Get him trapped in the corner, yes. It's always the best way to do things. Pure offense Got him. and power. I wish we had met under different circumstances. Rowan. Oh. Yeah. Well, so we, do I. We if gained levels up. just been like someone normal, like selling fruit or a hairdresser. <laughs> <laughs> we wouldn't so, have had to keep interacting with him. You're so harsh to him over. <laughs> All right, then. Is that Wingle dispatched if we kill him? All right. He's got Batman syndrome. Stronger. I'm clearly You're talking really in a deeper voice than what is natural for me. <laughs> Elbert. His Highness is right. If we destroy the Spyrixes, the world will change. You cannot force the world along a path it has not chosen for itself. That's a revelation I have finally come to accept. Rowan. Only now you stand there after all that has transpired. At the front of the fight, I'm pathetic of you. But I'm not finished with you. I must help His Highness achieve his vision. Why push yourself to the limit? Silence! Wingle, Gaius has not killed all of us for precisely the same reason. That he keeps you at his side. If you were to die here, then Gaius's ideas will... Not another word. Say no more, Hilbert. Ugh! <laughs> 
Pull yourself together! Could this be a reaction to the booster? Me? See how so so he helped me. Where are now grown Sati? Now what? I can't exactly leap these gaps in a single bound. Hurry, har har, Alvin! Quit kidding around! Huh? You'll make it. Just flap your arms and believe in yourself. Now who's a big fat liar? Seriously though, what's the plan? No getting back up there. <sighs> Rowan, I hate to say it, but it's hard to believe Wingle survived that. I know. Still, I think I heard his voice right at the end. What did he say? I could not make out his words. Regardless, it is not something that requires our attention at the moment. We need to focus on how to extricate ourselves from our present predicament. Right. I think the best plan is for each of us to move forward separately. We're all heading to the same place, after all. This a race? We all know I'll get the Gaius first. Was that lie meant to discourage those of us who will reach him sooner? Whoa, Gramps. Getting feisty. Ha! <laughs> I'm totally gonna be first. I'll say hi to Gaius for everyone. Zing! Good one, Elise! Happy trails, everyone. Wait, what now? This is, uh, isn't this what happens at the end of Final Fantasy VII <laughs> when you've got all green cubes instead and you're hopping from one to the other and there's like big giant iron giants and things just I, before you fight Genova? I don't know, I don't care, I think I'm all alone. <laughs> and we know what happens when that happens. Yeah, I get to make another cup of coffee, laugh at you a bit. Oh, <laughs> uh, the bad things happen. Or well, at least I'm elementally, oh, there's a danger one and there's a golden Bakura. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna risk everything. It's a single oh. fire element ultra. Oh, nice shot by me. Udine, water. Well, Udine. you know I can take it out. Udine. And I only actually have one water Udine. spell. My current weapon is fire. <laughs> so to be honest, Undine is literally Udine. all I have. You picked the wrong fight. Yes, <laughs> no danger monster can stay up against me spamming one spell feed repeatedly. Mila. She's about to cry about being hungry. Oh no, well, there's no one to cry to this time. Maybe she'll just leave it. We got some crazy music going on. Why did Wingle have to die there? That's such a pointless death in the he end. He might not be dead. His hair's still there. He regenerates from <laughs> his hair. As long as that's there, he can regenerate. You and his hair. Well, there's a golden Bakura, but I think the overall time it would take me to defeat that... Yeah, that would be ridiculous. You're elemental and they're all resistant to elemental stuff. Yeah, it's not exactly the cleverest fight to go to, I think. Just a little bit. I think we have enough experience. It seems we're going down though. We oh, we meet the... up with people. Oh, let's all split up for no reason. Yeah, that was a also, bit weird. Why can't we use the four to fly around? Yes, I've got the four. <laughs> I can get around these places. It's not hard for me. Can't Syl Sylph's got those flying goggles? Are they just for show? And she used to talk about Sylph floating around all over the place. Maybe she's forgot because, well, plotline forgettingness. I don't know.
shoot! A needless distraction. <laughs> he looked all mean and then he went, Rawr! Becca, you need help! So do I at the moment. I don't need help. You do! Don't you see? You're being yeah. attacked by three of them! You can't handle all them I need like to I do can! Is aqua sweep over and over until they're all dead. <laughs> So, the two of us reunited first. I had a feeling that would happen. What a coincidence. So did I. Now that we're together, let us kiss with tongues. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> well, I had an idea as well that it would be me and you the bit at first. So now that we're back together with Lilium Orbs to power up just a smidge, just the tiniest, tiniest bit, I'll take any kind of points I can get, to be honest, though, if you know what I mean at this point. Going towards the final battle, any stats are good stats. That's for sure, and you were getting agility just so you could look at all this like undiscovered terrain over here. Meh. Restore success rates, blah de blah de blah. What should we go for you next? That's Anything. the real question. Auto Anything. Fail. Stats I are don't good. Mind. Stats are good. Oh well, we'll just take the highest HPs and stuff. It's fine. Biggest stats, highest up. And we're gonna leave it for this episode, guys, because well Final encounters? Are yeah. bound to happen shortly. You guys are left hanging. I get to keep playing. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> so join us next time for more Tales of Exilia as we move onward, onward to the final battle. Bye bye. <laughs>